memories. Remember when we had that big dinner party with your two best monkey friends? <laughs> Mika! That's right! <laughs> oh, we've missed you so much. Yeah! <laughs> Almost as much as we missed you. Mm, this elegant batter is turning out great. Mm. <laughs> it's perfect. Wanna taste? Cake is always razzle pop berry flavor. That wouldn't taste right at all. Things sure are different around here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Do you remember the time we went to the top of the volcano? You two swung up there like it was so easy. While you climbed with a little help from your wings. And, and I got I there got first. first. Uh, I'm pretty sure Flap and I were the first ones to get there. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you went flat for the first ones you leave. Yeah, it's because it was so hot. Really, really hot. <laughs> <laughs> I'm leading the Dusk Fest song today, and we'd love it if you could trumpet along. We love to trumpet. That's Antique's favorite part. And one, two, trumpet! <laughs> Goes. I guess this is a case of you say potato, I say potato. I guess. But why would anyone say potato? Oh, look. The sun's at the tip of the trees. It's almost time to get back to town for the Tusk Fest. Oh, and I'd really like to bring a gift for Sway. Ah, oh, that would be nice. I seem to remember that we made a pretty good team. Uh-huh. You're right. We can make a gift together. It's definitely working. an enchantment that worked. Yeah. <laughs> We're getting better. Who's up for one more? Yes. Oh. Welcome, Enchantimals. I'm Felicity Fox, and I'm here to tell you it's showtime! <laughs> Today, you'll be seeing what happens when the awesomeness of the savannah meets the wonders of Wonderwood. And here to start the show, Merit and Compass! what happens when Sprint and graves his antlers in the dirt, but what if he's too busy in the clinic? We run and get him? Not if he's with a patient. That's why we're going to do this next enchantment, a new way to create healing herbs. Yeah. I love herbs. They're so useful, but also so lovely. We can offer them at our Slick Beak Boutique. Great idea. Why don't you and Flap do this one? Okay. First, everyone must hold hands. Now, skip to the left. Now, skip to the right. Ugh. Look, it's working. That's not an herb. That's a vine. A creeping vine. A creepy, creeping vine. Sorry, 
stage and caper, but it's time we buried it. Uh... The only thing in that book that makes any sense is on the last page. The end! See this lunchbox? This is what I'll use to carry home the always-frozen, never-melting ice cream. Wow! We can take ice cream on all our expeditions. Like when we visit Junglewood. <laughs> yep, Jayla. You could even take ice cream when you're surfing. <laughs> Which way do we go? That way. <laughs> that way. I'll get out my compass and map. Have you lost? I can't find them. Oh, no. I took them out to make room for your stuff, Flick. I must have forgotten to put them back. Oops. <laughs> no, Flap. We're not lost. Are we lost? No, Patta. It's been a while, but I'm pretty sure we know the way. Right, Jayla? Wait! <laughs> Flick, I really wish you'd found your backpack and packed on time, because if you had, then... Drawing of my angry face is not going to help us get to frozen wood. Though it is a very good drawing. I have an idea. How about we take a break and have a picnic? Who brought the food? Oh, I did. Oh, no. I left the food behind, too. We... we don't have any food? Maybe we should just go home. No, we can't quit now. I know we can find our way to frozen wood. Flap. Do you think you could fly yeah. above the trees so we'll know which way to go? Baby steps. <laughs> okay, I'll try. Snowy Mountain! <laughs> Snowy Mountain is that way. Good job, Flap. <laughs> the town's right down the mountain. Frozen wood sure looks frozen. Here's a scarf from me and one from Flick. Yes, Jayla. The sleds will be the fastest way to frozen wood. <laughs> Baby steps. Look out below, frozen wood! <laughs> One scoop of raspberry mustard seed ice cream? Yes, please. Still my favorite. I'll have what she's having. Is it just me or is Flag imitating all of Flap's badminton moves? Well, to be honest, some sheep can be real followers. I do wish Flag would use some moves of her own. What makes sheep great badminton players is our excellent jumping skills. You should see us jump fences. Maybe so, but we peacocks have flying skills on our side. <laughs> Tell me about yourself. What kinds of things do you like? Well, I love fashion. Me too. And parties? Me too. And making beautiful things? Me too. <laughs> Me too. Oh, sorry. It was your turn, wasn't it? Well, I'm sure there are plenty of things we don't have in common. I'm sure too! Boy, you weren't kidding about that sheep thing, were you? Uh, does it show? Nah, maybe a teensy bit. But one thing we do have in common is that our besties are becoming good friends. I hope they keep enjoying each other's company. Yeah, me too! Uh, I mean, that would be nice. <laughs>
Professor, uh, I was just wondering, is, is Flag over here? Actually, she is. But I'm not sure she's ready to go home yet. I overheard Flap suggesting a sleepover. Oh! <laughs> Don't stay up too late with the badminton tournament tomorrow. I need my partner in tip-top shape. <laughs> not nice. No water in Wonderwood Pond. That's awful. Okay, any theories? Hmm. Somehow the water has been let out. Maybe there's a plug. Yes. <laughs> Somebody probably pulled that plug. <laughs> you just need to plug it back up. Of course. Are you sure you have some interesting ideas here in Wonderwood? <laughs> Bree, you're the best fixer in town. Can you help us figure it out? Hmm. I don't know where the water is, but I think I know how you can get it back. You put the thingy on the doohickey and attach it to the bang diddy clang clang. Huh? Hmm. You've got the vaporizer -izer. And problem solved! Ooh. Great! Let's do it! We'll be performing in no time. Sure, how to put a doohickey into the frizzlator without a whippity whip. And I'm all out of whippity whips. Oh, what are the odds? Well, uh, if we happen to find a whippity whip, we'll be sure to let you know. Okay, bye! Oh. You're our last hope, Danessa. Can oh. you help us solve this mystery? Yes. Any thoughts on where the water is gone? Hmm. Well, I once read this old story about this really ginormous hippopotamus who loves bubble baths. <laughs> but she's so big, all the water spills out of the tub. So she travels from town to town, taking baths wherever she finds water. And once she jumps in, the water splashes out because, well, ginormous. <laughs> hmm, I think Sprint told me that story. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Makes sense. Makes sense to me, too. Me, please. That'll did it. Okay. <laughs> we'll keep an eye out for a wet hippo. Thanks, Danessa. Well, the pond still looks the same. Will we ever solve this oh so mysterious mystery? <laughs> that cranky beaver just interrupted my dramatic moment. Those other beavers we saw were very rude, too. Very rude indeed. Too <laughs> flat. Rude. Oh, that's weird, because the beavers around here are usually pretty friendly. Oh, that no. <laughs> oh. Hey! My instincts are telling me we should follow them and see what's up. Yeah, that does. Hmm. This is interesting. That dam wasn't here the other day. Ah, then I'd be new. Oh, no! Wait, what does that have to do with the babbling brook? This new dam is completely blocking the water from flowing down the babbling brook and into Wonderwood Pond. Ah, that solves the water mystery. But why are the beavers so cranky? Yeah! Mood! Well, they don't have any place to swim on this side of the dam. They like to be surrounded by water. Just like we do! <laughs> Silly beavers. We're gonna have to figure out how to move this dam so the water can flow again. Oh, but that will make those crabby beavers even crabbier. Too crabby! Mood! Well, we all want the same thing to be surrounded by water again. Oh! I, 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 uh, <gasps> Great idea, Flick! Be right back. I hope everyone in Aromafest will love my new snow cookies. <laughs> hey! No nibbling icing bandit! <laughs> hey, guys! Sage, caper! Take a sniff of my latest creation. <laughs> you two should go back to bed. We're fine. We'll see you in a room of <laughs> Now we have to make a whole new batch of snout cookies. Isn't that great? Yeah! Why can't I figure out something smelly for Aroma Fest? I keep coming up blank. How about 
about you? Ta-da! Oh, see? You've got something, Nosy. What's my problem? Hey, you guys. Ready for a Roma fest? Uh, what? I said, are you guys ready for a Roma? <laughs> Robofest? Not even close. I don't even have a whiff of an idea. Oh, well, maybe we can. can, can uh, 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 oh, thanks. <laughs> oh, goodness, sneezacious. You two have colds. Uh, uh, we gotta get you two to bed. Flick, we need Danessa and Sprint. Don't dig! Oh, you two really need to stay in bed and rest. I'm all right. I uh, 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 you are not all right. You have a cold and need to get better. But we have to... Uh, uh, to enter our fruity petunia perfume. Uh, <laughs> My perfume! It sure smells prize-winning. But, but uh, that's all we had. We have to make more. Whoa there, little stuffy nose. How can you make perfume if you can't even smell? I can smell fine. Let's play a little game. Close your eyes. First, smell this one. Now this one. That hand, you have the cantaloupe-scented walnuts. And the other, you have turnip-flavored eucalyptus leaves. <laughs> Who's stuffy nose now? Not even close. Huh? Peppermints and a lemon. Oh, how are we gonna win the best spell competition without our new perfume? I know. Flick and I will get everyone to help you make it. You just tell us what to do. Yeah! Well, first you have to... She says she needs a mitt of heathers to stir with. Heathers? Oh, we have some right here. Don't you love the purple? And here's some lettuce and mustard and onions. Are you sure that's what Sage wanted? That's what she said. Well, seems like weird stuff to make perfume from, but she is the scent wizard. I wish she'd wizard me an idea of something I could do for Aroma Fest. before I try it out again. Mm -hmm. These flowers are gonna make some great perfume, Caper. Uh-oh. Huh? Sneeze attack! Ah, uh, ah, uh, oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> <gasps> That sounds like Bree and Twist. <gasps> Break alert! Got it! Sage, Caper, I have something I wanna show you! <laughs> Funny guys. Now, who wants to see my super duper?
Super Enchantamaker. It makes a regular enchantment, uh, super duper. Uh, we'll pass. What? It's just, uh, well, we know what can happen when you... Hi! How's it going? Oh, hello. <laughs> fine, just fine. Uh, okay. <laughs> I'll see you later. Hmm. <laughs> Flick, whatever you do, you must not tell anyone else this secret. You don't want to ruin the surprise for Felicity, do you? Uh, uh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> don't try! <laughs> <laughs> yes, please try. If you just go straight home and don't talk to anybody along the way, the secret will be safe. Okay. <laughs> oh, Black! Oh, are, are you okay? <laughs> You're probably wondering what I'm doing with bags of flour. Uh, oh, oh, well, I'm uh, making a batch of my famous bluesy doozy cupcakes. All for me and Twist. Yep, yep, not for any special occasion or anything. Uh -huh. Well, uh, gotta get baking. <laughs> Bye! <sighs> I'll see you later. <laughs> wow, what a great idea. I'll get more balloons. Heck huh? Whoa. Mm -hmm. Oh, dear. <laughs> uh, uh, hi, Blick. Uh, Wondering why I have all these hats. <laughs> nope. Well, I love hats. Yeah, a lot. Which is why I have so many, because I love them so very, very much. But then who doesn't love hats? Well, I guess non hat lovers don't love hats. But that's okay, because there are plenty of hat lovers loving hats to make up for the non hat lovers. <laughs> and I am a hat loving lover who loves hats. <laughs> love, 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 love. Now hold tight while I get more balloons. <laughs> I'm fine. Uh, sprint! No, hold on! Just how to take care of a swollen ankle. Great! Catch me up, cause Flick and I have a few more adventures lined up for this afternoon. <laughs> yeah! Mm -mm -mm. The only way to heal an injured ankle is to stay off of it. You need to stay in bed until it feels better. <gasps> bed? Never gonna happen. <laughs> It's too hard. Well, let's see how that ankle is doing. Ow! Mm, just as I thought. It needs a little Wonderwood tender love and care. Now is it healed? Just a little longer. But it's already been forever. And there's nothing exciting going on around here. I think we're gonna need some help. Uh-huh. 
Adventure makers to the rescue! Keeper and I were thinking that if you can't be on an adventure, at least you can relive one. Remember these? Bloom Blast! Yep. Remember the time we found some growing on the far side of the babbling brook? <laughs> yeah. We were racing paper boats. remember the part about you winning. But I do remember when you accidentally fell into the Bloom Blast shrub. Ah! I meant to do that. <laughs> there were these weird looking flowers growing all over the place. <gasps> Danessa! Yeah, that's right. We decided to pick some for Danessa. Ooh, I picked the most. Mm, don't remember that part either. But I do remember we picked armfuls of Bloom Blasts. We never figured out what made them explode. Oh, hi, Sprint. Whoa! <gasps> Antler alert! <laughs> Antler alert times two! What happened? It's a mystery, but um, do you think you can make me some new ones? Hmm, do you think they could have shrunk in the wash? Oh, I don't think so. Don't worry, we can make you some new Absolutely fabulous new antlers. Oh, great. Um, uh, just don't make me quite as shimmery as you did for the hide-and-seek tournament. Not a problem. I'll tone down the shimmer and turn up the awesome. my own breath away. It's a masterpiece. I really like these antlers you've made for me, but... But? It's just that I still miss the old ones. Time for some cheering up. Whoa, never thought I'd say this, but I'm speechless. Well, maybe speechless, but not jokeless. Looks like we've got some work to do. <laughs> Ta da! <laughs> Did that cheer you up? Sorry, guys. Well, thanks for trying, but I think the only thing that will cheer us up is finding my antlers. Well, that's a job for Felicity and Flick. They're the best finders in all of Wonderwood. Great idea, Sage. We'll track them down. They're probably out having an adventure. Come back if you don't find the antlers. We got lots more green pies. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see if they're in the meadow. Oh, there's Felicity. Where's Flick? Oh, I don't know. It's not like her to go somewhere without her bestie. Come on, 